champion big mountain skier and Alaska helicopter skiing pioneer, Dean Cummings, has spent the last 18 years going deep into the Chugach. Let's follow along as Dean shows us what access to goods means to him. In 1990, they hosted the World Extreme Skiing Championships and they brought the best skiers in the world to come up and, and see the place and to compete. And the idea was to get Valdez, Alaska on the map and, and show how good and amazing the skiing was here. You know, when I arrived, it was, it was obvious to me this was the best skiing in the world. And we knew it right away when all of us arrived. It was like, wow, this is, this is it. This is the top level of skiing and, and guiding as far as remote guided aircraft operations. You're going out into terrain that doesn't exist anywhere else and it's just so vast and so big and the scale is so large that you know you really do have to develop people to understand back into protocols when you bring them out there. Aircraft guiding really began in Canada and then took hold in the U.S. But it was definitely not implementing backcountry protocols. It was guides basically guiding people down the mountains and using each guide as a backup and basically just having the client follow the guide. The best part of Alaska protocols is we evolved the guiding principles to educating the person you're bringing into the mountains in developing this group team emphasis. Um, they, they learn how to use safety equipment, the avalanche transceiver, the probe, and they carry a shovel, they carry extra food and warm clothing. The goal is to have them understand it, to implement it, and be a, a huge part of the day. They're not just gonna be following a guide around. They're gonna be out there participating and, and taking on a role within the group to increase the safety and. It also increases what you can access.